Welcome back. I'm joined by Gina Graham with Creative Interiors. Gina, thanks for joining us. Oh, thanks for coming. We are in a bright, bright, bright room. Tons and tons of color. Yes. I'm loving this. Uh, this kind of gets me in the summer, springtime mood. Mm -hmm. And this home is really nice because of all the different antiques. And she has really, um, really nice style with her fabrics that she picked out for the spread. She went and did the pattern first on the spread. And then she went from there, she went down to the walls and then to the window treatments. One thing that we did that was real unusual here, well, a couple of things, but the one thing is um, her rods and everything, we never moved. They've been here the whole time. So I made the curtains to fit exactly her rods. So what she had, so we didn't have to move anything. She didn't have to buy anything new. Um, and then we just did the Roman shades underneath the valances. And we were actually talking about Roman shades uh, when I first got here, mm -hmm. and I said, oh, I'm seeing this in more and more homes, and I said, why is that so popular? Because of the fabrics, because you can pick out any kind of fabric, and it's different than just a woven shade or a roller shade that's just like a, a bamboo or, you know, kind of a gritty. You can do that, like she did the yellow, so it's a complement color. She could have done the navy, she could have done the red, but it's, um, it also gives you the privacy with it. So there's a lot of options there, and it's not just blah. Blah. That's a, that's a technical <laughs> term. But I think it looks great in here and I love that, you, like you said, she just gets to pull out one color out, right. of, out of there and, and put that as the shades. And mm -hmm. it, the, per, the yellow to me was the best option. I think yeah. that's beautiful. Um, and it's got, you know, we t we're taking the pattern from the window uh, to the bed and, you know, onto the other wall as well. But on the flip side of the uh, windows, it's got a little bit of like a checkered pattern almost. It is and it's um, a real pretty blue plaid and it's so surprising. It was a really large plaid but it was the perfect color that went with the pattern in the spread. And instead of just doing a solid, which you could always do, you know, you always try to throw in one more color, you know, you don't just want two. If you can do three, it's great. So the plaid had a little bit of yellow in it and it's real subtle. So we did it on the inverted pleats on the um, shades or on the balance and then around the Roman shades, we did it on their valence. So they're just little touches. And then like on the comforter and the shams, then on it, we did the yellow around the shams. So that kind of brought that in there. And I know you said there was a couple of things that made this really unique. And we actually have something I've never seen in one of the rooms we've gone to. Right, um, she did do shams here. So she's got the pillow shams that you can take on and off, but um, you know, we like to change our mind a lot. So there's times when you don't want shams. So we did a pillow tuck. And there's two types of pillow tucks. You can do a regular pillow tuck or a reversible pillow tuck. It depends on your fabric and how you make your bed. Um, but the really nice thing about that is it fits all the way back underneath your pillows. You never have to worry about it and it folds exactly right into place. And that's very uh, oh, yeah. easy and it's, it looks very neat. Right. I think, and that's something I haven't seen uh, that we've come out. And I, I'm always learning something new, yeah. and this is something that I really loved. And you said that is, it's very versatile. Mm -hmm. It is. And then the other thing with this one that we did that we haven't done for a while is we quilted it, um, and we outline quilted. And whenever we can do that, that's, I always love that because it makes each pattern in the, in the fabric stand out a little bit more and it kind of centers it, so that was really nice. What I love is someone comes in with a, you know, a pattern or an idea, and you find those tiny little touches to make it a little bit better, a little bit brighter, and that's what we go to you for. Yeah, well, and it's their home. They want their own personal touch, and that's what we try to help make them have their own home and their own personal touch. <laughs> it is, and this pattern really is, you know, very vibrant, very, you know, it stands out. So I love that we you know the rest of the room kind of is subtle on its own, and this is the pop. Yes. I think that's beautiful. Now, of course, I always say this, if people have no idea to a ton of ideas, you guys can help them and they just need to stop in, right? Yes, we're at 5280 Scottsville Road across from Greenwood High School. We're there Monday through Saturday, nine to five. There's three or four of us come over anytime. Yeah, and they can make your room, you know, just as personalized. Like you yeah. said, everybody wants that little touch and you guys can do that, which I love. Yeah, Gina, glad to help. Gina, thank you so <laughs> much. We'll be right back.